is at this stage of the game that Tormenta started to find life offensively. They earned the penalty, score on the penalty against Chattanooga, tied things up at one. And Luca Meyer, a couple minutes later, gave them the lead. Arslan's shot from distance. Uh-oh, do we have a repeat? That late life again after the second half hydration break, and it's Chad Arslan. Two goals against Greenville last year, has another here. Another look at the replay brought to you by the Islands. Arslan takes his face, takes his shot, beats Dallas J off the post and in. He does play to their strikes here into Meyer. Luca Meyer needed that breakthrough for Tormenta, and he gets it in the 11th minute. South Georgia on top early. Take another look at it on the Islands replay. Giveaway at the back. Just as I was saying, this team believes the bigger field plays to their strikes. Bad giveaway at the back by Kroll. And in behind New Hoop before he can do anything about it. Fourth corner already. Another unsuccessful try. Nicoletto. Here's point blank range, and we are tied. Thorne. The right back all the way up in the attack. And in the 19th minute, Tormenta FC equalizes. Galetto creates a ton of chances, leads the team in that category. He creates another one here, a beautiful ball. Thorne unmarked, and that's an easy tap in for him from point blank. Rosales, the last line there. Now for Gomez, a little no look pass there for Micheletto. Thorne, his cross, header, Tormenta in front. Two magnificent services, two magnificent finishes on the goals for Tormenta FC tonight. Two unanswered after the early Fort Lauderdale goal and the 63rd minute. Look at this ball from Thorne. Perfect. 